guys, it's Tori and welcome back to my YouTube channel. So today, I'm going to be showing y'all how I do some big, beautiful, popping, beachy curls on this wig that I got from Beauty Forever Hair. But it ain't about the wig, y'all. It is about, speaking of, it's not the best install you've ever seen, but it definitely ain't the worst. I'm going to be talking about the Duval Impulse Professional Flat Iron. They sent it to me. I'm so grateful. I literally curled one of my wigs last night. And it turned out really cute. If you go look on my Instagram, the pictures are up. But I'm gonna do it a little differently than I did in that pictures and stuff because they were like a little crusty. I really like it. Um, from the times I have used it, I really enjoy it. I think you guys will enjoy it too. So, um, everything will be linked down below, and my link, my code is what I'm trying to say. My code will be down below, and everything that you need to know about this will be down below. Okay. And it ha it goes all the way up to 450 degrees, but we're gonna turn it on. This is the on button. And it glows red it's super cool it's it's really nice and sleek and heavy duty it's not super heavy so as you can see it like glows and stuff and it heats up pretty fast so i just put it on a 360 because i don't need super hot but it heats up pretty fast and before i finish and keep going into the video yes i have a list that's because i have my invisalign in so please don't say anything okay i know i know i know i know but excuse the fact that this side is straight and there's like a couple curls in this because i did a little uh bit of loose curls in this all right so we're just gonna brush this out it should be heated up by now we're gonna like brush these out as best as possible because you know so we're gonna start i'm gonna show i'm gonna flat iron this and show you guys what it looks like um before so while we're still waiting i'm gonna like spray a little bit of this on there just so it kind of protects it a little bit because it's like flat. I don't have a comb in here or anything, so we're gonna see how straight it gets without me chasing it. I like to bump the ends, but it didn't work. But as you can see, with one pass, it got it bone straight. So, and that's not even all the way up. So if that doesn't show y'all something, then I don't know what does. But I don't want this um, wig straight, so I'm gonna curl this pee. So as you can see, I just wrap the hair around and slowly slide down. This won't be the best tutorial you've ever seen. I'll do a little, I'll tell you guys what, um, how to really do it in a second. But you just take your time and you know, it curls. And I'm taking like decent sized pieces because I, I mean like, like not too big pieces because this flat iron is not that big. So like the, the um, plate and stuff is not that big. So you don't want it to be, you know. So you just flip the hair over and kind of twist it and pull it down so it gets all the hair and that's literally how you curl the flat iron hold on let me move it over so it doesn't get like messed up and i keep twisting it just to make sure it gets all the hair and if you get to a point where you can't twist it anymore just like clamp it if that makes sense and keep twisting so it gets all of the hair and you see that's how you that's how you do it that's how you do it that's how it's done okay so i'm gonna keep taking more pieces and eventually after you guys watch me do it a couple times i will uh, just go ahead and do a um a time lapse a little bit of a time lapse and then i'll probably come back and finish, do the other side off camera but just make sure to take your time with this so the hair can have a proper like proper amount of time to like heat up and actually do something but i don't curl all of mine the same way either because i don't want all of them to like flow together really i wanted more volume so i don't curl all of mine together and see she's bomb she is so bomb she curls so good and flat iron so good
Okay, so guys, I'm going to do the rest of this off camera and then you are going to come back, see me brush it out and I'm going to give my final thoughts on what I really think about the Duval Impulse Flat Iron, okay? Okay, so yeah. All right guys, so here are the curls, all finished, all done. So we're going to brush them out and then I'm going to give you guys my final thoughts. Ooh. Give you guys my final thoughts on the flat iron itself. So give me a second. I love the color of this hair. I think that's what really does it for me is the color. Look at that. Look at that. I wish this piece was a bit more curly. I might go back and do that again. I'm going to do it again right now. Okay, there we go. Oh my god, I'm so hot. <laughs> Never did I say that on camera, but literally gas yourself up, girl or boy, whoever. But I'm definitely here for the volume. I definitely like the side more. Why did that slide do so much better than that side? I'm so confused and it's gonna make me cry. Okay, but as far as this is concerned, I think it looks really, really cute. I really like how it looks. But my final thoughts on the flat iron are it works really good, especially for curls. I like how they turned out. It's just you have to be patient with stuff like this, but that comes with any flat iron. But I like how this turned out, and I just really like it overall. Like if you're going to invest in something and splurge on a flat iron, I recommend this one. Everything will be linked down below, so anything else you want to know about the flat iron will definitely be down below, so you guys can go figure out whatever you need to figure out, but I really like it. I enjoy it and I would never lie to y'all and never like tell y'all something that wasn't true. So yeah, I think it's definitely worth the money and that you guys should get it for sure. So comment down below if you plan on getting it or anything like that and just let me know what you guys plan on doing, okay? And yeah, I'll catch you guys in the next one.